The police might be bringing the, the the guard in. I'm not really sure. But you can see here they are. So there's a bunch of police officers. Maybe they're assisting bringing the Humvees in. This is what it looks like. Soldier there. So more military vehicles just uh, parked. There's another one just up ahead. This is uh, Massachusetts Avenue. Just, um, this is northeast, just past the Capitol. Two blocks. There's another one here. This parks. So there's no one in them, but they're here. Yeah, so here we go. So it looks like the police are assisting. There's a Humvee right there. So it looks like the police are assisting um, with the placing of them right now. So I guess they're coming into town now and they're just now getting set up. So you can see there's another soldier there just in front of the Capitol. Another one here. So it's interesting. They're they're parked like uh, within neighborhoods. So that's kind of just very strange. I don't know. That one might have a soldier and I can't tell. There's definitely a police officer there. So they might just be coming in now. I don't know. I'm keeping my eye out for them. And then uh, tons of police everywhere too. You can see these are all police cars. I don't know what, why they're up here, what they're doing. Also, you got the uh, plow trucks are, just, are being placed as well. So there's one here. There's another uh, military vehicle there. So they're kind of parked all in the neighborhood. It's very strange, um, but that's where they're staging them now. So you got snow plow trucks all over. Gosh, I could post two hours of videos today, really. Um, but so we're kind of coming past about two blocks from the Capitol. So we'll see if there's anything on this street here. So there's a soldier there outside of a van, right? So here you go. So they're basically on every uh, every block right now. Looks like. So that's what they're currently setting up. See, there's more up here. They're just getting here, so they're just they're literally coming in now. Here's another one here. Okay. And that's there's a soldier in that one. You can see. So basically, as we drive down here on Fourth Street, so we're about four blocks from the Capitol. Um, every block there's a military vehicle sitting. It looks like they're coming in now. So we keep my eye on it, I'll drive around a little more, see if I can catch them on the move, uh, getting parked, go ahead. Um, but that's the latest from here. So again, now we're kind of, there's the Capitol. So there's right three there. vans full of soldiers right here. One, two, three, I don't know if you saw that, but they're all right there, all soldiers. So what's interesting guys is this is Pennsylvania Avenue right here. It goes directly with the Capitol. And so none of the vehicles, none of the military vehicles are out here on these main roads. They're all in the neighborhoods. Um, which is, I don't know. I mean, I don't know what, I can't, I don't want to make two cents of anything anymore, but, um, up and down Pennsylvania Avenue, there's none of them, but in the neighborhoods, the Humvees are kind of parallel parked on the sides of the roads. There are some kind of about a block from Union Station. Um, but you can see if we look down here, there's none. So make this left. Um, sorry. Gas is, uh, 469 a gallon here in the city. Um, then you got these empty circulator buses. Make another left, please. Um, so yeah, so that, this, this is what it looks like. And so as we come, come down here, and there's a bunch of police all lined up. So I'm gonna see if we can find them. They might be the ones that are escorting the vehicles through town. I haven't caught any yet, but I'm looking for hey them. Hey guys, it's just before five here on Sunday, the 27th. And uh, this is the DC National Guard. And so it's RFK Stadium here. I used to go to HF Festival there years ago, if anybody remembers that three day concert. But anyway, the parking lot is relatively full. You can see the shuttle vans are here. So the National Guard looks like they're operating out of here. And you can see, they're being assisted by the police, uh, which are here. And so I've seen the uh, Humvees parked all out of outside of town, in town. And you can see, so they're um, they're here. And it looks like they're putting them in place now. I'm not really sure exactly what for. But anyway, that's the latest as it looks like here. You can see there's... there's so another uh, guard vehicle here. This is just in front, four or five blocks from the Capitol. So you can see the National Guard is here. They all have police with them too, so I'm not really sure what that's all about, but they're here parking their vehicles. This is a National Guard van here. So, they're here, Washington, D.C. I'm not sure if you can see these guys coming through. They're literally headed to the Capitol. The Capitol's right behind him, behind them. That's totally illegal, okay? There's no tag, no registration, no nothing, like little mini bikes. And they just cruise through town like that now. Some have helmets, some don't. And this is uh, Pennsylvania Avenue, so they're coming right through the main part of town and there's no enforcement. So I'm over here by Union Station and they got all these spotlights set up as well. So this is beyond the fencing. You're gonna see the fence in a second here, but they got, you see these Sunbelt Rentals. And then, you know, right here's the Capitol and the fence, uh, that's the fence, uh, you can see it. So, you know, they, they have these spotlights all the way out here. Look, I mean, two sets of them. 